it seem like we feel the same We love what we hate We lie, but we know We can't wait to win How to start a conversation with the Lord. Hello friends, this is Yundel and today's share is about starting a conversation with the Lord. This is just a share from my own life experiences and of course from my own reading. I am sharing with you my spiritual lifestyle. I survive life because I live in my spiritual way of life, reading the scripture, knowing that God is with me all the time, knowing that I am not alone, knowing that no matter what, I survive life because through God and God alone, He is with me, He is leading me and guiding me every day. My faith with Him is so strong that I feel I cannot survive life without His blessing, without His presence into my life. Yes, to survive life, I must do the work to read the scripture, to have time to communicate with Him, to lean upon Him, to call upon Him, to converse with Him. Start a conversation with the Lord today. When you are in doubt, when you're struggling with problems, when you're struggling with anxiety and depression, He is the only one who can go through, talk to Him like you are talking with a normal person. Talk to Him and tell Him everything about your life. Tell Him that you cannot take it anymore. Tell Him that enough is enough. It's time for a change. Be specific to tell Him everything about your life right now. Of course, when you're struggling into something, it's hard. But believe me, He is the only one who can help you without any judgment. He will not judge you. He will, he will be there for you. All you have to do is to take the time to have a conversation with Him. A time to talk with Him. A time to be with Him. You can do that out here in the nature, you can do that in your room, or you can go to your happy place and start your conversation with the Lord, talking to Him what you are worried for, what you are struggling for, what challenge you are facing right now. Talk to Him. Voice out everything when your heart is painful. Take it to the Lord in prayer. Tell Him everything about your life right now. Remember that He will not judge you. His help is free and His love is unconditional. And He will support you and be there for you through thick and thin. Believe me, we all need God and to have God in our life we have to start a conversation with the Lord start talking with him right now start telling him about everything in your life start to open up to him tell him everything what you are struggling for tell him what you are doubting for tell him why you are frustrated right now remember in this life journey we all need someone to talk to and for me in my spiritual practice i trust him i believe in him so therefore i have to call upon him talk with him every day through my prayers and meditation knowing that he is the only one 
who can comfort and embrace me, who can lead me to the right path. A conversation with God is a must for us to do, especially when we're struggling of something. Think what a privilege is to have full access to the kingdom of the universe and through God in all his glory has an endless amount of critical and important matters to attend to. He wants to hear from you. In fact, it is God himself who give you this gift to open a communication with him. That's because he loves you and wants to hear from you. He is interested in everything you do and say and can't wait for you to tell him about your day. He wants to hear the details and you can trust that he doesn't see you as a beast or a bother. One thing you can know for sure is that God doesn't glance down at his cell phone and say your name. No! Then roll his eyes while he pushes the decline bottom. No, rather, he gets excited knowing you. His beloved child is reacting out, reaching out to him. Reach out to him. You are his beloved child. The Bible says in Philippians 4, 6, and 7, Do not be anxious about anything, but in everything by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your request to God. And in 1 John 5, 14, We are given the assurance that God not only listens, but He hears us. He hears when we have a conversation with Him. This is the confidence we have to approach God, that if we ask anything according to His will, He will hear us. Make no mistake, God wants to communicate with you. He loves you and wants to share what is on your heart, including the good, the bad, and the ugly. And don't forget to listen, for real communication is a two-way street. So start your conversation with God today. He can't wait to hear from you. As it says in Mark 11, 22, And Jesus answering said unto them, Have faith in God, for verily I say unto you, That whosoever shall say unto his, this mountain, Be thou removed, and be thou cast into the sea, And shall no doubt in his heart, But shall believe that those things which he said shall come to pass. He shall have whatsoever he said. Therefore I say unto you, What things soever ye desire, ye free, believe that ye receive them, and ye shall have them. And then ye start praying, Forgive if ye have ought against any, that your Father also, which is in heaven, may forgive you for your trespasses. Start your conversation with him, telling him everything you need, everything you are troubled with. Believe in him. Comfort yourself that you can come unto him. Start your conversation with God today through your prayers and meditation. To start a conversation with the Lord, you can write it down. Start writing it down what you are going to talk about. You have to be aware what you are going to ask. You have to be aware what you are going to pray. Because He wants us to be specific in everything we need. He wants us to come unto Him fully. And believe me, His help, His comfort is all free indeed. All you have to do is to set a time to have a conversation 
we the Lord use your energy conversing him instead of crying instead of the frustration instead of being worried of your problem stop the worrying you are not alone God is with us all always he is with us he will lead us he will guide us but all he wants us to do is to communicate with him through conversation through prayers and meditation if you really want to live your best life take away the doubt take away the anxiety and the depression and all those things can be gone when you start a conversation with the lord this is your death Thank you for listening. Thank you for dropping here in my channel. I am very grateful to each and every one of you supporting me here in my life journey. I love you all and bye bye. Like we feel the same we